The web is something we interact with every single day, but have you ever stopped to think about what actually goes on behind the scenes? Imagine waking up in the morning, grabbing your phone, and opening your favorite website. Maybe it's YouTube, Instagram, or your go-to news site. It loads almost instantly, displaying all the content right where you expect it. But how does that happen? What's making everything work so smoothly? Today, we're breaking it all down in the simplest way possible so that by the end of this video, you'll have a clear understanding of what web development is and how websites come to life. Web development is the process of building and maintaining websites. It's what makes the internet function, from the way a page looks to how it processes data and responds to user interactions. Think of a website like a restaurant. The front end is everything you see as a customer. The menu, the tables, the ambiance. The back end is like the kitchen, where chefs and staff work behind the scenes to prepare your food and make sure everything is running efficiently. And then we have full stack development, which is like being the owner of the restaurant who manages both the customer experience and the kitchen operations. Front end development is all about what users see and interact with. It involves three key technologies, HTML, which structures the content of a web page, CSS, which styles it with colors, fonts, and layouts, and JavaScript, which makes it interactive. For example, when you hover over a button and it changes color, that's JavaScript in action. The front end is crucial because it affects the user experience. If a website is slow, hard to navigate, or looks outdated, users won't stick around. Next time you visit a site like Netflix, pay attention to how smooth everything looks. The hover effects, the scrolling animations, the clean layout, that's all thanks to front-end development. But what about everything happening behind the scenes? That's where back-end development comes in. The back-end is responsible for processing requests, storing and managing data, and making sure everything works properly. When you log into Facebook, for example, the back-end checks your username and password against a database, retrieves your profile information, and loads your feed. It's the invisible engine that keeps everything running. Backend development uses programming languages like Python, PHP, Node.js, and frameworks like Django or Express.js to build the logic behind a website. It also relies on databases to store information, such as user accounts, posts, and comments. Think of the backend like a brain. It processes all the inputs and sends back the right responses almost instantly. Now, if someone knows how to build both the front end and the back end, they're called a full stack developer. These developers can create entire websites or applications from start to finish. They understand how both parts work together and can switch between designing a user-friendly interface and coding the logic that powers it. Full-stack developers are highly valued, especially in startups and small businesses, because they can handle the entire development process without needing separate specialists. Imagine a full-stack developer like a chef who not only cooks the food, but also designs the restaurant and manages the staff. They ensure that everything works seamlessly from start to finish. So how exactly does a website work? Let's say you type google.com into your browser and press enter. Your browser sends a request to Google's server, which processes the request, fetches the necessary data, and sends it back to your device. Thus, your browser then takes this data and displays it as the Google homepage. This process happens in milliseconds, and it's the result of a combination of front-end and back-end development working together. Think of it like ordering food online. You browse the menu, place an order, and wait for the restaurant to prepare and deliver your food. Websites function in the same way. You request information, the server processes it, and the result is displayed on your screen. Now that you know what web development is, which part excites you the most? Are you more into designing beautiful and interactive websites, or do you love the idea of working behind the scenes, managing data, and making everything function smoothly? Drop a comment below and let me know. And if this video helped you understand web development a little better, don't forget to like and subscribe for more tech breakdowns. See you in the next one.